what this month's bag looks like and it's just so New Year's Eve ish so holiday-esque I feel like all the fuzziness I don't know I just think it's really cute so the first thing I'm gonna pull out of here and I'm gonna use is this Brigio Briogio Curl Charisma Rice Amino Plus Quinoa Frizz Control Gel. Just took a shower and my hair is just a little bit of, a little bit of damp. <laughs> a little bit damp. It's like a fuzzy gel consistency. I don't know if you can tell what it is. So I'm just gonna put that in my hair and see how it works out. I have really curly hair and it's super frizzy because of all the stuff that I've done to it. And because curly hair is just generally dry and frizzy. This light whole gel is infused with frizz fighting rice amino acids, nourishing quinoa and tomato fruit, firming to enhance the texture of your curls. The gel shapes and defines curls without sticky or crunchy after effects. Ooh, it smells really good. 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 Ooh, it smells really keep my hair not looking frizzy and define the curls um while not making it crunchy i hate when my hair feels crunchy because of a gel like it's just so annoying i'm actually going to especially put this over here my hair fell out a couple of months ago and it's finally growing back so it actually looks like i have a crown like of curls around the front of my hairline and it's not cute. The next thing I'm going to use is this snow cream moisturizer. It looks pretty weird and cool. So this is what it looks like. It looks like it has a weird consistency. What? This this feels so weird. It's like a putty. It's so weird. I don't know if maybe this would be better for nighttime use. But, just for the purpose of this video, I'm going to be trying it out. This is really weird. Oh, it feels really cool. Like, actually cool and temperature cool. <laughs> and also, if you're doing your hair and are touching hair products, always make sure you wash your hands if you're going to go ahead and start doing your makeup or putting moisturizers and stuff on, because you just... You don't want those um, hair chemicals and hair products to clog up your pores. So this feels very thin. It doesn't feel heavy um, or too thick. It feels very refreshing. Um, and it actually feels like you're putting a peeling gel, like a peeling mask on, and then you're just working it in. But it actually feels really nice. So I didn't get any face products. I'm going to go ahead and put all of that stuff on. And then I'm going to go into the rest of the products that I got in this bag. I finished up my foundation, concealer. I put some bronzer on, eyeshadow. The next thing I got in this Ipsy bag was this City Color B Matte Blush. It has like a perfect springy pink, a mauve -y, purpley pinkish tone and a deeper uh, rose shade. I don't normally gravitate towards these colors but I do love this one so I'm going to use this one today. I'm going to use the 125 brush from the BH Cosmetics Sculpt and Blend 2 set and I'm going to take this color. Wow these are super pigmented. And, um, just, whoa, apply it to the apples of my cheeks. This is super pigmented. I didn't think that it would be. Okay. Wow. I think I went a little bit too far. So I'm just going to diffuse it out with a bigger powder brush. There's nothing on it. Um. I'm very impressed with this and this is so cute, little and on the go type and I love those types of products. This is the Mad Lash Black Mascara from The Balm and I'm going to apply it to my eyelashes. Um, I'm going to curl, oh wow, you don't twist it, you just pull it. It's a huge wand. Um, so I'm going to curl one eyelash 
I'm going to do this eye and then I'm not going to curl this one just to see how it works out. I'm actually very impressed with this mascara. I love the balm. I love that brand. Um, I just never tried their mascara out before. I have tried out their eyeliners, um, their tinted moisturizer, but never a mascara, and I am very impressed with this one. And the last thing that I got in this month's bag is the Tarte Maracuja Oil. So the directions say, At night, apply two to three drops of maracuja oil in your hands, rub them together, and apply to clean, dry skin on face and neck. However, I know that they have so many uses for this oil. If you don't follow Tarte Cosmetics on Snapchat, you should. I love those girls. Um, they do such a good job at like explaining different ways to use their products and they use them all the time. So I'm actually going to use this today to moisturize my lips. You can put this on your skin, not just your neck. You can put this on your body. You can put this on your cuticles. You can put this everywhere. It's just like any regular oil except it has like those magic powers that other oils don't. My lips feel so soft now. I'm going to... What lipstick do I want to wear? And on my eyes I used the Rose Gold palette from Huda Beauty. I'm going to review this, just give me some time. I know I mentioned it on my Twitter. Um, just give me some time to get back into the swing of things. And I have so many things that I purchased and I have so many things to talk about, but just let me roll. Let me roll in. Okay, so I'm just gonna use this one. Um, this I feel like matches my overall tone that I'm going for. So this is the first Jeffree Star liquid lipstick that I've ever owned and I'm just kind of fascinated right now. Um, I'm just going to be applying designer blood all over my lips. This wand is actually the best liquid lipstick wand that I have ever used. And this is the first time I ever tried this and I am in love. However, as pretty as this lip shade is, it is not even 12 o'clock and <laughs> I'm not one that rolls like this. So I'm going to change it to something... Um, that I would normally wear in the daytime. Even though, like, who cares, right? This liquid lip is popping. So, okay. We're just gonna, like, screw people today. Like, if they have something to say, whatever. Pop, 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 put your number twos in the air if you did it on a... And also, as foundation, I used Tarte's Empowered Hybrid Gel Foundation. This is new. And I've just been testing it out. This is my third day in a row using it. And I think I've gotten my final thoughts on it. So make sure that you subscribe so you can stay updated with all my videos. I do feel like this made my liquid lipstick look so much better. Usually I get all the cracked lines and stuff. But this definitely did its trick. Those are all the things that I got in this month's Ipsy bag. Let me know in the comments down below if you got anything that I did and how you feel about it. As for now, that is about it. Thank you guys so much for watching and thank you for sticking in there for the past three weeks that I've had and gone through mental, mentable, met, multiple meltdowns is what I was trying to say. Um, it's been a pretty rough end of the semester for me. But it is over, and I thank you guys for sticking around. So yeah, uh, make sure to subscribe to this channel if you want to see future videos. And be sure to press the bell button too, so you can be notified whenever I post a video. And yeah, I think that's about it. Be sure to like this video if you did, and I'll see you in my next one. Bye! <coughs> what was that? <laughs> Bye! Did I have these two spots in my teeth this entire time? That is so embarrassing. Anyways, that was rude. I didn't let me know how you 